with the changes to the uh, A-levels and the new syllabus, uh, we decided we wanted to take a new approach to teaching, which involved using the graphical calculator specifically. I think they give us a bit more scope for development of the way that we teach. So we can take it, instead of just looking at the abstract, we can start to get into graphical representations much quicker and it saves the students quite a lot of time as well. The students are very used to using Casio calculators, um, so actually following on from that with a, another sort of Casio calculator, they know roughly where a lot of the buttons are anyway. It's fairly intuitive, yeah. you get used to it quite quickly. I like the fact that on the, the normal equations, like working out things, it's a list of everything, it doesn't yeah. disappear. So you can look at like, you can, yeah, you past can refer history. back to your, your previous yeah. calculations. Definitely. Useful. Solving um, polynomials like quadratics and quartics and all that, it's much easier, you just have to fit it in. Inequalities on, on graphs and everything is all a lot yeah, easier. They are able to explore a lot more so they can change their variables much easier than they could with pen and paper and keep them more engaged by giving them the power to change the variables, change the question, look at what happens when we alter certain elements and then that leads into a better lesson. We're promoting fully that they use them in the exams because we think that the, uh, the benefit to them is those calculations can be done quickly, meaning they can move on to the next question that bit faster. You can check everything, so you can check every answer and be pretty much 100% sure that you've got it right. Before we've looked very much at the mechanics of what the calculator can do to make everything quicker and simpler, whereas now we are looking at it as a tool to develop the experience um, and really develop the understanding rather than just a basic calculation tool. So it, it guides our teaching and our higher order questions as well. It lets them play around with it so much and very quickly get an answer to something that may be uh, beyond their current skill set to sketch. Being able to draw functions, so if you get given an equation you can then get it plotted on the calculator in a graph format so you can understand it in a much better way than having to visualise it mentally. Yeah, especially getting to know what the different types of graphs look like as well in general because you get to then you remember kind of easier, it's easier. So we're trying to promote the use of it lower down the school so the students from a, you know from year 9, 10, 11 get used to using those calculators so it's, you know, they're not it's not a brand new thing when they come to do it at A level. Mm. I think it's got so many benefits for the visual graphs in particular, you know, doing the integration, the differentiate, all of it, I think, and the stats as well is very good having all the tables on there. I'm looking forward to using it actually with the data set now. Let's see what we can do with that. I can see the benefits to the students that they've had um, and therefore that makes our jobs a lot easier as teachers to make sure they're, they're progressing.